Welcome, my political friends of the interwebs. Um, this is going to be a book project update. All right, we're going to start moving forward uh, with this project. I had a little bit of a setback. <laughs> I got to sneeze. <laughs> Damn it. All right, anyway, had a, <laughs> had a little bit of a setback with, uh, with that whole uh, colonoscopy thing, but that is behind me now, literally. Um, okay. I talked to uh, uh, Lee. Or I didn't talk to him. I actually communicated with Lee Durham of How the World Works, and he just could not fit this project into his schedule. Um, I told him that I'd like everybody's uh, essays to be back by the end of July. He just couldn't do it. Um, but he said, "Look, he goes. I wish you guys the best of luck. If there's anything I can do to help, don't hesitate." So. That's cool. Um, so I've come up with the final list of people that are going to be in on this project. There's going to be some important things, details uh, coming in this video. So if you're on this list, pay attention. It's important. Okay, I'm going to read the list. Artisan Tony, Lamb Dog 76, Riston 59, Carrie 3570, Stephen Hayes UK, Hoss USMC, Salty Shellback, Mad Bad Voodoo, Propaganda Buster, and Kami Forna Tactical. All right, these are the people that are involved with this project. All right, here's the deal. Um, I've been talking to Stephen Hayes. Uh, well, communicating with Stephen Hayes. He's in the UK. Um, he has a lot of experience with this. He's actually published ebooks, as you all know, or should know by now. Um, so I asked him, I said, Stephen, what format does this need to be in uh, for, uh, for Amazon, for the Kindle? And he said that he, all the essays need to be in Word. Okay? Now, Salty Shellback had sent me... Uh, his story and it was a PDF that won't that will not work so everybody that's working on this you might as well just start working on it in Word um, and I think just for Stephen Hayes has agreed to help um, kind of edit this for for continuity and everything and put it put it together for us um, but to make his life a whole lot easier let's just agree that um, the font should be New Times Roman okay um, Bot size, I don't think makes as big of a difference. Uh, I'll, I'll, whatever you're comfortable with, he can always change that pretty quickly in Word. Um, let's see here. Um, they the the essays should be between six and and ten thousand words. Now I know that seems like a lot, but truthfully, it's really not. You know, I think your average book page is going to be somewhere around five or six hundred words per page. Um, so if you do the math, it's not crazy. So do the word use use the word count and make sure you know. I mean, I'm not saying throw a bunch of filler stuff in there to stretch it to six or to ten thousand words, but keep conscious that you know whatever it is that you do needs to be you know a, 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 I mean not huge, but you know well six to ten thousand words, simple enough. Um, or as I said, you know ten to fifteen pages, whatever. Okay, so now, uh, so we, we can agree it's all got to be Word. It's going to be New Times Roman font and six to 10,000 words. Uh, Stephen had a, a, a couple of suggestions that I want to pass along to you. Um, in fact, <laughs> let me read you one of the things he wrote to me. Uh, we were talking about, um, you know, we were talking about the formatting and all that stuff. He said, the biggest issue is content. It needs to be varied, engaging, not completely negative, and well-written. And to that, I have to say, Stephen, you're setting the bar a little high for me. <laughs> I'm not going to speak for everybody else, but <laughs> well-written. <laughs> I'm screwed right out of the gate. <laughs> you know? um, Stephen also wanted to know about um, the, the title of the book. Well, I tentatively have, have called it um, uh, The Right Side of the Interwebs, a collection of um, essays from some of... Uh, YouTube's conservative bloggers, whatever. It, it, listen, that was tentative. Uh, if anybody has any ideas for a better title, uh, let's share this. This one, I want this to be a true collaboration. Which brings me to the way we collaborate. Everybody, if you could, please send me to my um, madbadvoodoo at gmail.com uh, email account. And spell the voodoo just like I do on my channel. Okay, which is 1-0 at the end of uh, voodoo. Uh, send me an email address and title the email address um, uh, just with your name. Okay, so Artis and Tony, send me an email and uh, in the in the body of the email, just put uh, Artis and Tony. Or in the subject line, just put Artis and Tony. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect everybody's email addresses and then we're going to share. I'm going to send them, I'm going to compile it. I'm going to send all the email addresses out to everybody. 
Okay, now if you do not have an email address that you want to use for this project, and, and or let's say you want a, a different email address to use for this project, uh, go to mail.com or Hotmail or Gmail or whatever and create one. <laughs> you know, but um, I don't want to do this through Google PMs. I just don't. I don't. That's not going to work for me. Um, you know, it's just it's not as efficient as a, a an actual email account. So let's get everybody's email to me, and then I will send everybody's email out. And then here's what's going to happen. So as you uh, send out, what I want you to do as you finish your um, essay, send that essay out to everybody, <clears throat> so they can all read it. Um. And that way we can vet each other's work and we can, you know, do somewhat of a, you know, I mean, you know, I've got somebody in my life that is um, a writer who will edit uh, my content because I can't spell to save my life. <laughs> you know, spell check's the greatest thing that ever happened to me. Um, but I have somebody that will edit uh, uh, my writing. Uh, if you don't have somebody like that in your life, um, maybe we can help one another with that because, you know, none of us on this um, list, with the exception of Stephen Hayes, uh, is, as far as I know, a professional writer. Not that Stephen's a professional writer, he's actually a, a medical doctor, but, you know, well, okay, whatever. <laughs> Stephen's got more experience in writing than, than most of us that I know of. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe, well, I shouldn't say it because Propaganda Buster, I'm sorry, I didn't even think about this, but Propaganda Buster actually was writing articles for a Japanese newspaper. So, uh, I take, I stand corrected. Truthfully, uh, Propaganda Buster's uh, a go-to guy, too. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry about that, Tony, you know, um, which reminds me, I need to give you a call today. So anyway, having said all that, um, okay, so send me your emails and send me what, maybe what your idea of, of a, uh, a title should be for the book. Um, and copy everybody. Once you get everybody's emails, you can copy everybody. So, you know, if you decide to send me, okay, I'm going to tell Maybe Voodoo that um, I think the book should be titled this, then you can copy it to everybody. We'll get a dialogue going. Ultimately, like I said, though, in the end, I am the captain of this ship. So, <laughs> you know, it is what it is. Um, but having said all that, um, let's move forward with this project. Uh, Salty, if you can redo yours in, uh, in Word, that would be awesome. Um, let's see here. Riston59 sent me his, I, dude, I haven't even opened it yet, but I will. I'll, I'll make a, pr a priority of doing that today. Um, but anyway, listen, welcome aboard, everybody. Let's try to make this work. Stephen Hayes had hoped that we could get our, um, essays to him, uh, by, I want to say he said the 12th or 13th. Um, I don't think I can even do that, to be honest with you. I'm going to try, uh, if, if we can try, but don't rush it, you know, um, don't rush it. He just had kind of an opening. Um, where he had so he, he had the ability to, to work on this and listen I'm shooting for everybody to have their project in um, their essays in by the end of July but if it takes us a little longer or if Stephen Hayes can't get to the the compiling of it end of it for another month whatever you know um, haste makes waste and and uh, and I mean that because in my life that's been my experience anything I've ever rushed has turned out like crap so but um, but that doesn't mean we procrastinate either <laughs> so anyway I'm rambling at this point everybody get your emails to me uh, let's move forward if you've started working on this uh, essay and you've been doing it in a different format other than word in New Times Roman um, you know you need to change that if you're not familiar with so let's say for example you've been you've got about I don't know five pages six pages ten pages done in um, in uh, Courier or some other font, just go to Edit, select All, and change it to New Times Roman. It's that simple. Um, and then just save that. So if anybody's got any questions, let me know. I'll be checking for your email addresses very, very shortly. Um, and that's all I got for you. Everybody take care. See ya!